You know, we're doing five five-minute movies being directed by some of the world's top directors, basically. And um, the fact that they're going to they're made for the internet is a you know it's a it's a very, it's a whole thing is a completely new approach. And um, I think they'll have a huge impact. Go back again, please. I want you to come up and pay them. Action to us. We set out to make a five minute film. And we want the five minutes crammed with excitement. And we pretty well planned that out before we started it. If you just go in and try and wing a scene like this, you're just asking for disaster. To me, music is, is part of the sound, and uh, a lot of people think music, music is like to create a mood or create a, uh, it's always like a background. But I think sometimes the music can, can be the front and the image can be the back. It can play like that. The music should dance with the image. If you lose them, just keep moving. Hope for the best. I think just running back is kind of dull. If you can get run back and do a little bit of a spin, then that's a better shot. After doing Crouching Tiger, I just fall in love with the, with the choreography. Each, every car is trying their best to do their jobs. And when you try to figure out what must be in their mind, what's their reaction to what, then choreograph the number from there. And I think the number could look very interesting, very intriguing. Three, two, one, bang! One thing I learned from the previous movies is that you don't want to leave out the actor's face for too long in the action sequence. I think it's a great thing we bring the audience along with the characters, just experience what they experience through. Get down! I didn't want Clive to play a James Bond type character. I wanted him to um, to come with something a little more um, humorous and took to this um, extremely well. He's quite a funny character, Clive. We had a stunt girl in the back for doing this. We um, got her hair, we cut her hair just like Madonna's and dyed it just like Madonna's because a wig wouldn't, well, just wouldn't stay on. Um, so, you know, the stuff where she really gets pounded around and the, the stunt girl really did get pounded around. Um, it's, it's, you know, it's, there's, there's no problem trying to believe that uh, it is Madonna at all. I always told Clive that uh, there's five films in these projects, and it, I think each film has different approach, and, and even he's playing the same person, but there's always different characters. Action! The notion of being able to do five independent movies that were of a length that could be downloadable um, and that could be their own distinct in the same way that each model of the car is distinct and has its own um, demographic and you know whatever the distribution entity whatever the, the whatever the pipeline is it still seems to me that you need to give people a reason to watch.